Good morning guys, so I don't really have much to update you on. I'm gonna bake an old school cake, but I'll probably do two old school cakes. I kind of wanted to take some into work tomorrow, and I thought if I'm baking, then I might as well just bake <laughs> for like a few people. So I'm gonna basically try and make two of them. Just went to Morrison's in my break, got some stuff and got some dinner for Bernard's parents because they're coming around for dinner tomorrow, so he's gonna do steak and chips. I will update you guys in a bit. You've seen me make old school cake before. I kind of just want to get it done, so I'm not going to vlog the process. Okay, guys, it's my lunch. So I'm watching Married at First Sight UK, and then I've got leftover curry. So I did have curry yesterday, which I obviously didn't show you. Um, so that's what I've got. I have made basically three old school cakes, but one large one, a medium one, and then like a small one, which I'll show you afterwards. Um, but I'm going to let them cool down. And then the, for once, I'm actually going to ice them in the tins because I see a lot of people doing that and I think that'll be so much easier. So I'm going to trial that out. Might do it on the smallest one first and see how it goes. But obviously, they're going to take a good few hours to fully cool. Um, but I will show you guys when they're done. Right, guys, before I finish cutting and forgetting, I've managed to get 15 pieces out of this, which I think is quite good. I've got nine pieces out of that one and I haven't cut that one yet. So I've boxed up some for a friend. This I'm thinking for work, so I'm gonna put straight in here. And I'm thinking just to keep it on this so that I'm not like touching it, picking it apart and stuff, I've just pre-cut it. Normally I get 12 out of that, but I thought people aren't gonna particularly want a big slice. So I've got 15 there, but I feel like I'll take a few extra. Me and Bernard will have quite a few. So I'm thinking maybe I'll take that to work and then me and Bernard can have like three each if I cut that. So I'm back, I'm literally steaming up the whole house. I have made spaghetti bolognese, but I've used, oh, I'll put it out in the thing, but I used the new spicy chili bolognese dolmio sauce. It was new. And I was like, oh my God, like a spicy bolognese, let's do it. So I've just made Bernard's lunch. I'm gonna put like some old school cake in a thing as well. So I've got leftovers, but I need to obviously do my lunch tomorrow and then I might obviously be able to foil up one. Um, I am currently cooking myself some pasta because I didn't cook enough for three meals. So yeah, I'm gonna try and let you guys know what I think. I'm gonna dry my hair and then plan my outfit for work tomorrow because I have no idea what I'm gonna wear yet. Yeah, so I'll probably vlog tomorrow if I remember. So I'll speak to you guys in the morning. Guys, 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 I am fuming. I got up at half five, so tired, got all the way to the train station. They canceled my train five minutes before it was supposed to come. Then the other ones were delayed. So I thought I'm not waiting and I'm not sitting on trains that go around the houses and like get to work late. Like I'm just not doing it. So I've come back home. Now I've got to try and get the egg of getting a refund and I might not even be able to get a refund. And then to make matters worse, my yogurt burst all in my bag. Now that's on everything. But this was my outfit of, of the day. What a waste of time. Like what an actual waste of time. Like I'm actually fuming. So I think I just need to like take a breather and come back to this. Good morning guys. So I literally didn't finish vlogging yesterday, which was really bad of me, but his, the boyfriend's parents came around. So we cooked steak, chips, we did some tomatoes, some stuffed mushrooms. And then they was here for like a few hours. So literally when they left, I went to bed. So there wasn't any point in vlogging anything. Just received my Amazon parcel. So I don't know if I told you guys, but basically I'm trying to, let me open this first. I'm trying to put some lights in the garden down the end so that obviously when I let the babies out in the morning before I go to work, I can see them and I don't have to just go blindly and trust that they're not gonna leave the garden. Um, they don't really because they know that they've got their bickies coming and they're obsessed with their bickies so they're always in and out. They haven't really jumped the fence touch wood for a while now. So yeah, I've just ordered some. So my dad's been helping me because I ordered a light and where it's gonna go, it's too probably too heavy for the thin bit of wood. And I couldn't be bothered with the faffing of working around it and then he needed to give me cables so he recommended these so I've got two of them and this is what he's got in his guard his garden and they're quite bright so I've got the rest coming today so I'm gonna have to wire a plug which I've never done I know that sounds silly in the sense that my dad and everyone else are saying it's really easy so I'm hoping that I can do it but you know these are things really that you need to be taught in school like actual life lessons and things that you're going to need and put into practice you know so yeah i got away for the rest i've got an extension lead some plugs some fuses maybe something else but now i can use a drill and stuff because obviously guys i need to learn to do this stuff like i need to be independent and be diy but at least this comes all wide up and i've just got to put it into the plugs so that should be quite good so i probably will start that today if they come on time ring my dad to make sure i'm doing everything correctly 
Um, it's just a shame I live so far from my parents because I could have just told my dad to come round. He's got so many tools that he could just do it for me. Um, and I still haven't put my door sign on that I needed to do. So maybe once I've experienced doing this again, I can do the, the door sign. So yeah, that's all the update. I should have Lululemon coming today, but that is for a video. I've managed to upload two vlogs, edit the vlog and upload it. And then I had one already edited. Upload my other fashion over video, do my boom bar and bloom chic reels need to send them over so yeah it's been quite productive work has been so 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 busy like it's pure stress but we've got two new people starting next week so that will give us four people on the service desk plus my manager and then we have one that's in two days a week so we will have like five people on the desk for two days which is really really good like we've never had that in like the four years or three four years whatever i've been on the desk but yes that's all i have to update you guys on at the moment pumpkins in the garden makers on the kitchen so i will try to remember to vlog because i've been enjoying doing quite a lot of vlogs and doing mini like 10 minute vlogs okay guys so my lululemon parcel has just come so i'm going to go try them on um obviously i'm not going to show you on the vlog but i'll show you like what i picked up in the colors what else do i have to say to you i have to say something else i can't remember what it was now yes i have been online shopping looking at more like vintage outfits i can wear and things for new york i wanted to make an order on aliexpress for like some vintage stuff and do like a little video but the shipping was like 11 pounds like i'm not paying that <laughs> just i can't you know when like even if it's like four pound shipping and you make an order and you're like yeah no i'm not paying postage that was me four pieces so like a sleeve bodysuit they're super soft but they're really really thin and then i got like a high neck sleeveless bodysuit and then I wanted to try like a t-shirt because like sometimes it's annoying to wear bodysuits, so I got that one. And then I'm excited to try this one, so I think I'll try it first. But you can tell this one's double lined because it definitely would have been see-through. So yeah, I'm gonna try them on. I'll kind of maybe summarize my thoughts here. So I've just finished trying them all on. I will say they are nice. They have more fin than I expected. Um, but yeah, I'll save the rest of my review. So I am just on my break at the moment, obviously got like 40 something minutes left of work. Gonna go gym, do some cardio, might do a bit of arms. Oh, I've got no idea what I'm cooking tonight. Oh, I'm gonna get takeaway. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna be naughty, so I better burn some calorie. The rest of my stuff came for the lights for the garden. So probably sort that out later. Good morning, guys. So I'm just getting myself dressed finally. I am on the late today, but um, this morning I decided to install one of the lights outside in the garden so today i have learned well i wouldn't say how to learn a drill or <laughs> learn how to use a drill or anything because i've already done that so i learned how to wire a plug today and let me tell you it is very fiddly when you have nails but that's up it's just i need to sort out if i'm going to put another one around the other side of the garage um so i'm going to wait till it's dark later and then obviously i will Turn the light on, see if I need to put another one up. If I need to put another one up, I need to sort the extension lead because obviously I can't have the wire hanging like in mid air with the extension lead. It's not safe, but they're not going to be permanent lights anyway. They'll just be as and when we need to use them, dressed and sorted so I can go for a little walk because I did an hour and 15 of cardio yesterday and I was going to vlog when I came back, but the camera was up here. So I was like, oh, I can't be able to get it. So yeah, all I literally did, I got a takeaway. I had sausage and chips. I played with the cats and then I just booked an excursion for New York. And then I was on FaceTime to my sister for like 40 minutes. So yeah, didn't do much. I decided I'm gonna film my Lululemon video like either over the weekend or like on Monday. So I will update you guys in a bit and I will show you the light I think later when like I've turned it on and let you guys know. So I just got a parcel. And I didn't know that I was getting a parcel today. But I think this is my beauty bay. Yeah. I didn't order that. It's a freebie. Ooh, I love freebies. I'm gonna have to check. So I picked up some Jeffree Star there are some Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick. Now, the reason I picked these up, I'm not wearing these on my lips. I put them on my eyes as eyeliner. 
So they were finally on offer. So I got some colors that I need that I can't get in eyeliners. Like if I had a makeup company, I would 100% be doing all funky different kind of eyeliners because that's just obviously what I love wearing. But like brands don't really do like out there eyeliners. It's literally like your simple boring colors. I'll get them all out and then I can show you. My sister's gonna be like, oh my God, you shouldn't be ordering stuff. I got this gorgeous like orange color. Then look at this green, absolutely stunning. I will have to try these on my lips one day for the lols. And then I didn't really need this one, but I was thinking like a different kind of pink would go well. So I got this color pink. So they are the ones I got. Absolutely love them. And they were on offer, I think they were like 13 pound each. But I do really need to go through my eyeliners and get rid of ones that I don't have. So yeah, I got this freebie, I guess. We're gonna open this together. Bloody hell! It's not a full on set! Oh my god! Surely that's got to be quite a lot to send out, like as a freebie. Opened it, so you get a brush. So I'm going to give my mum this brush, and then... Oh, I'm a bit off showing it this way. Three... Sorry guys. This is why I'm not a makeup YouTuber. Three of these. So I'm thinking I'm going to keep this one because I haven't got a colour like that. I think my Selena Gomez one, the Rare Beauty one, is like that. My mum will probably like one of these two. So I'm going to offer her either or. But yeah, <laughs> little bargain for me. It's the simple things, eh? So yeah, that was uh, my little haul for you. Um, I've got a few dresses actually for my mum to try on as well. So. She just like she loves all this. I kind of miss living at home with um with her when like I used to get all my parcels and like you know my freebies from like companies and clothes from companies. Cause she would love it. She'd be like trying them all on as well, like I was gonna give them to her. But obviously, like some items that I don't keep, I sell on vintage, I donate, or I'll give to like Sprout or my mum. Like nothing ever goes to waste in that, and yeah, they just love it as well. So that is everything. I swatched the colours actually. Love them. Definitely get a lot of use out of the pink and the green, that's for sure. Um, I might try that green actually on Sunday because it might match my Oogie Boogie thing. But one thing I love about Jeffree Star is like his packaging, always on point. That was all I had to update you guys on. I haven't done much. I just feel a bit lazy today actually, but when do I, well, I was gonna say, when do I not? I'm always doing stuff. So I just kind of like need to tidy up the house a bit, empty the dishwasher, put all my stuff in the dishwasher. But I'm on the late today, as I said, so I'm working till half five. Babies are upstairs snoozing and I need to plan dinner, actually. What I could do is put a wash on, to be fair. I need to do that. So yeah, I will catch up with you guys in a bit. Mm -hmm. 